Welcome back to Talk of the Town. We are joined by Christopher Roach. This is such a fantastic local story. There's such magic behind it. It's one of those things where it was a perfect storm of fabulousness. Yeah. Ring Stinger Pepper Company. Indeed. And we have these gorgeous peppers here that I understand came from your garden? They are, so we've got uh, four gardens here in the county. Uh, one here on Hilton Head, two in Bluffton, and then one in St. Helena with our partner farm, uh, Myers Family Farms. So. Yeah, we keep it as local as is humanly possible. Our family's been here literally since the beginning. Uh, and so we try to keep it all as local as is humanly possible. So. Sure. And sometimes people come up with like this this dream that they want to create sauces or, or jams or jellies. But you know what? You've been in the business 26 years. So front, front end, back end, you're a chef. Tell us a little bit about the, the why sauces? Why not just source out peppers? Uh, so unlike most kids today, I walked in at 14 years old uh, to the Hague Point Clubhouse and said, I want to start washing your dishes to get into the kitchen. And started uh, in the kitchen. And then a guy didn't show up who was the prep cook. And they're like, you're now our prep cook. And then the line chef didn't show up. And they're like, now you're the fry guy. And eventually worked my way up through the School of Hard Knocks. And 26 years later, um, have worked every position from ownership to management to whatever it may be. Uh, I was in kind of a gnarly accident in 2012 and it took me out of the kitchen, moved me to front of the house. I went and got a degree in restaurant management, kind of moved to the front of the house and had been there since uh, 2012 and really missed the kind of kitchen game. I had been making a couple different sauces. Uh, Susie Greenburn is a sauce that I've been making forever just for friends. Susie Greenburn. Um, I'm a huge fish fan, kind of how our company got based. It was kind of in the fish community. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of our sauces kind of have uh, fish references. Uh, but we have a membership base that kind of founded us as a company. And so <sighs> inside of that tight-knit communities, which Hilton Head certainly is. Yes. Um, so it's kind of the band community. And most bands kind of have that tight-knit uh, community. They and do. They backed me. And so it was kind of the ability to start the company. Uh, I work at Michael Anthony's as well here on the island and yeah. so fortunately have access to uh, their kitchen to make sauces and then their owner I went to and was like, hey, I'm going to start a hot sauce company. I need help with the name. And Ian, who's one of the owners and the general manager, actually helped me to name the company as well. So, so uh, where, Ring Stinger, what is, what is the, behind that? How did you come up with that name? <laughs> it's one of those things where you don't want to be crass, um, but you want people to understand that your sauces are hot. Um, and so we kind of... Um, Moving on. Yeah, we kind of wanted to go with something that was Moving a little... Moving on. Moving on. We're a little yes. dignified here on Talk of the Town. We should move on. Yes, yes. Um, so um, this, this is just so fabulous. And I love that. Really, at the base of it, food is music. There's musicality that comes yeah. to all of it. And I love that that's, you know, that there the are references to fish. And, and when would you even have time to go see fish and follow them? Uh, I have, yeah, it's kind of crazy. <laughs> Since uh, 95, uh, the keyboard player's father was actually my table parent oh my uh, here on Hilton Head, Paige, Dr. McConnell. Uh, who started Volunteers in Medicine. Yeah. And he knew that I was huge into music, and I've been into music since I was a kid. I had a mohawk, like, way young. It was kind of <laughs> crazy. And he was like, hey, you should go check out my son's band in 95, and wow. gave me tickets to the show. Uh, and that's all. It awesome. wasn't necessarily my bag then. He right. gave me tickets again in 97, and at that point, things clicked, and You're I went, I'm hooked. Uh, I'm 165 shows in. Whoa. My daughter's name's Fiona with a PH. We're kind of a little, uh, a little deep in you it. You know at what? This nerd point. out. There's, there's got to be an area in life where you can just nerd out, and for I just sure. love that. And for clearly, sure. your passion and and what I love is you've just driven deep with every part of oh, this. Yeah. It's one of those cohes cohesive designs that you just want to devour. Okay, so where can we find your stuff? So ringstingerpepper.com. Uh, is our website where all of our you know current availabilities are. We also have this really kind of, again, I'm community-based as, as Hilton Head is, and so we started an online community, which you can also find as Ring Stinger Pepper Company, but people post their recipes and what they're using in the mon, and people post pictures every day of kind of uh, their kids eating sauces, and we've got videos of like kids testing sauces, and it's just become this 
um, really intimate group. And so beyond just the company aspect is the Facebook page has become really communal, which is kind of it's fun. It's one of those immersive brands. Um, I yeah, love and we, that. we started small and we're growing organically. We just uh, picked up Tio's restaurant, a Mexican restaurant here on the island. They're fabulous. We're going to be making their house sauces for them. So people who want to go taste what we're about uh, before buying can And it'll go be over dumbed there. down a little bit. It'll be a little bit more. Absolutely. So we're going to do a mild and a hot taco sauce. It'll be their table sauces, squeeze bottles style so a little mellower than kind of what our hot sauce sure, rum is sure. um, and then we're also going to do a chipotle hot sauce for them and then we're kind of working on something possibly doing a little bit of a peach and habanero hot sauce for them as well I love um, it. so the people who want to kick it up a notch yeah. can do that as well but definitely the the milder taco based sauce is something that we don't sell as a line mm. so we'll be exclusive to them as a restaurant Bam. so um, picking up some restaurants there and we've got another barbecue restaurant in georgia that's going to do barbecue flights with different flavors of our sauces that we'll create for them. Um, and so that's something that we're available to as a company is kind of uh, for independent growth for your company as yeah. well. Um, but then besides ours, uh, kind of an example of what we grow as a company mm. and what we're about, uh, we keep it all organic and we're about local sourcing. Uh, and, as and much that as is, And that is possible. the deal. And folks can come and find you, Ring Stinger Pepper Company. Christopher Roach, so good to spend some time with you. Thank you so much. We'll be right back with more Talk of the Town.